This right here is a Nicoboli. Oh. Dough, pizza sauce, meat, and cheese made into a delicious worm sandwich, if you will. This was created in Rehoboth Beach and is now known all over. The place it all started, Nicola Pizza in downtown Rehoboth Beach. Uh, this pizza place has an incredibly interesting story. It was actually started out of a house in 1970. Over the years, it's grown into what it is today. It's loved by locals. It's a must visit for out-of-towners. Here's Del Marble Life's Katie Zarelli. For almost 50 years, residents of Rehoboth Beach and those who swing by in the summer have filled the booths at Nicola Pizza. The legacy restaurant started as a way for Nick and Joan Caggiano to pay for treatment for their daughter's spina bifida. They had a lot of bills, you know, a lot of things going on. They wanted to, um, they needed some extra money. So he actually started selling pizzas on Friday night in 1970 out of his house in Bay Vista. His pizza making started to pay off, and soon after that, so did his wife's social skills. She found out this space was available, but where would they get the money for it? That's a question the family, to this day, can't answer. Someone in this town in 1970 knew the situation with my sister, knew the situation with mom and dad, and signed a promissory note for this business to start. That first summer, there were only 12 seats in the place. They got by on the bare minimum. No money for paper plates, so they used to serve they used to serve the pizza on napkins and aluminum foil. That true story. They quickly became popular, and business really took off a few years later. That's when Nick Sr. invented his famous Nicoboli. The lifeguards who ate here on break were wanting something new. And they said, Nick, why don't you make us, we're just tired of hamburgers, you know, could you ever think about whipping something up, you know? So he said, you know what, I'll try, you know? So he got the dough, put the beef down, sauce down and cheese, did his little roll of it, you know what I mean, and threw it in the oven, and 20 minutes later, 50 minutes later, it came out, and it was a hit, a, a hit ever since. The Nicoboli is trademarked, and people come from all over to get their hands on one. You'll see pictures of some famous faces on the walls. They've even delivered Nicobolis to the White House, and they love first-timers. There's a lot of the customers that come in for the first time that somebody has sent them in here and they'd say look you got to go to Nicola Pizza and you got to order get this Nicoboli don't even ask just order the thing you know I get that a lot but I also get what is a Nicoboli all right I gotta try the famous Nicoboli and I have the creator right here this is this is big you're talking to him right here, baby. <laughs> Nick Caggiano Sr., you Absol said... Absolutely. You absolutely. said, and you said, don't go for the uh, utensils. Just pick it right up. Oh, you pick it up. Right, yeah. You yeah. just pick it up like All right. this. Yeah, yeah. yeah. okay, oh. okay, okay. Here we oh. go. Nice and crunchy, you know? That dough's nice and crunchy. Mm -hmm. That cheese is melted. That is and delicious. Soft. I want to tell you. Mm -hmm. I mean, that beef, oh, it's perfect. Perfect. How and many the of these would you say you've eaten in your lifetime? Just, uh, I, I can't begin to tell you how many, you know, right. because basically, you oh. know, oodles of them. Not, oodles. Not, not, not every day, uh -huh. but I would say almost every other day. It is so good. I'm going to go for another whole oh, bite. Oh, absolutely. I'm going for it, you know? <laughs> Nick, I love it. Yes. Well done. Oh, yeah. Nicola Pizza opened their second location just up the avenue in 2010. Dining room on the bottom, upper deck sports bar on the top. The business that once had 12 seats now has a few hundred, and these seats fill fast. Just as time brings growth, it also brings loss. Joan died in 2017. One half of the heart that started this place is no longer here. Joan was a huge loss and you know everyone misses her daily. We still have some customers that will come in that haven't been here for years that didn't know that she had passed um, and you know it's very difficult for us delivering the news sometimes to them. We have found ourselves oftentimes us <laughs> the son and niece consoling you know someone who just was a customer but that's how much that she meant to them and to this community. At 83 years old Nick Sr. isn't as involved as he once was but he cares as much as he always has. And his family members who are carrying it on share that same spirit. I always say it's sort of like a marriage, you know, you have to want to get married. You have to want to run a restaurant. You know, it's just the way it is. You know, it's 
Is it 24 hours a day, seven days a week? Of course, everybody says it is. Of course, it can't be 24 hours, seven days a week. But is it 22 and a half hours, six and a half days a week? Yes. Started for family, run by family, Nicola Pizza is a legendary member of the Rehoboth Beach family. Delivered to the White House. Delivered to mm. the White House. Oh my goodness. Nick says Nicola Pizza is also known for its longtime employees. That's not hard to believe. No, it's not. It's really not.